what does sickle cell pain feel like? Sickle cell pain, also known as sickle cell crisis, can feel like a dull ache or sharp jabbing pain and can be mild to severe. This pain can come on suddenly and out of nowhere, affecting different parts of the body like the arms, legs, back and the abdomen. Some individuals describe it as worse than being in labour or post-surgical pain. Can sickle cell affect Caucasian people? Yes, sickle cell disease and sickle cell traits can affect people of all ethnicities, including Caucasian people. Although it is more common in people of an African descent, SCD is not exclusive to any particular ethnicity. It's important that individuals of all backgrounds to be aware of their sickle cell status, especially if they have a family history of the disease or come from populations where it's more prevalent. A quick blood test can determine if someone has sickle cell trait. How to test for sickle cell? It is diagnosed through blood tests that detect the presence of the abnormal haemoglobin which causes the blood cells to become sickle shaped. The importance of testing. Testing for sickle cell disease allows for early diagnosis and management of the condition, potentially preventing complications. Carrier testing is important for individuals who may be planning to have youngsters of their own, as it can inform them of their chances of passing the condition on to their offspring. In the UK, screening for sickle cell and thalassemia is offered to all pregnant women and newborns to identify those who may have the chance of being carriers. What foods should those with sickle cell avoid? Limiting meat with high iron content, fast foods and refined foods is also important for sickle cell disease. Does sickle cell cause yellow eyes? Yes, sickle cell disease can cause yellowing of the eyes, a condition known as jaundice. The yellowing of the eyes happens because the sickle-shaped red blood cells break down more rapidly than normal, leading to a buildup of bilirubin, a yellow substance in the body.